Hello guys, good evening. Today I am taking you on a night point of view drive with the new MG HS. This is the facelifted version. Highlights on the front include the new grille. So not only different uh, in terms of the shape, but also you see the pattern is different than the new LED lights. And this is the luxury trim. So you see the indicators, they're nicely integrated into the bumper. 4 meters 61 is the length. This is the new color for this car. It's called Magic Gray here in Croatia. Urban Gray on UK configurator, I believe. And then the wheels, 18 inch with the beautiful dual tone. So these are the new wheels on the luxury trim and then 17 inch would be standard. Now moving on to the rear of the car. Here you can spot the new signature for the LED lights at the rear. LED lights are standard on second and third trim. So the uh, comfort and luxury trims. This is once again the luxury trim. And you also spot the new bumper and the real exhaust pipes. But they have different finishers on this facelifted version. And you can open the tailgate by pressing the button or with the key here. So let's press this. And now you will see that the tailgate opens and we are greeted with a nice square shape. There we go. So yeah, I think now we are ready to start the drive and share your thoughts with me. How do you like the exterior design of this car? How do you like the changes? And how do you like this new color? And now we are off to the cabin and uh, look at this. So let's see it from driver's perspective. There we go. And put the seat belt on. So we have the lovely layout here. Ambient lights, digital cockpit and the main touchscreen. This is the gear lever for the seven speed automatic transmission. And we can put it to drive. Uh, so you have the seven speed DCT or the six speed manual available and off we go I will talk about the details during the drive itself model in our video has got the 1.5 liter turbocharged four cylinder petrol engine and it is producing 162 horsepower and 250 newton meters of torque that is enough for an acceleration from 0 to 100 in 9.9 .9 seconds while the top speed is 190 kilometers per hour there's also the plug-in hybrid variant and then the model is called the ehs but of course the focus of today's video is gonna be this one so the hs model with the petrol unit front wheel drive of course and let's talk about the layout here in front of us digital cockpit 12.3 inch one and the main touchscreen is the 10.1 inch one the ambient lights there are different colors i will show you that as well the layout here in the middle you have two usb ports and also the cup holders you can put the rollers and i will now take you on a night drive in my hometown of zagreb i hope you will love it and I don't think there will be much traffic around us. It's practically 2 a.m. Okay, so it scanned the camera and we are ready to go. We have the 360 cameras and you can turn this on or off. So when you are at low speeds and turn on the indicator, then you have this assist and as you can see empty streets and we are enjoying the drive and this SUV so in terms of the interior it's a well-known interior and you have of course more changes uh, to the exterior on this facelifted model now on this car you can now go for the style package with the blue details as well this model has the standard luxury trim without the style package inside I'm not sure how much the camera is catching it but on our left you can see the national theater and then you can see it here as well so that's cool and I can now also change 
the ambient light colors so there are uh, some shortcuts here and by the way this is to turn off the start stop system now the lighting ambient light settings and now here we can configure them out so tell me in the comments which one do you like I will put the blue one now or this sort of like the purple ones actually and there are also other options a lot of options available share your thoughts with me which one do you like the most and also it's got the pulsing mode as well so you see the lights are now pulsing but I will keep the standard ambient lights on I prefer them on all the time and uh, yeah well this infotainment system 10.1 inch one a well-known infotainment system and I mentioned the shortcuts here volume home button max blow and then for the AC you do need to touch the screen so you do have the button here you go into the AC settings and now here you can adjust the air blower and the temperature as well And this car has a bunch of driver assist and safety systems that make your drive safer and more smooth. You can adjust them here, so you have a bunch of options and then you can configure the way they work. And yeah, so this is the standard interior for the luxury trim with the uh, black details here then you can go for the style package for the interior and uh, it can be a red one which was also available on the predecessor but now also the blue one with very cool blue details uh, blue seats I would really love to see that as well so this car uh, has the standard option I also filmed the model with uh, this specification but inside it had the style package with red details but I didn't yet film the blue one so hopefully I will be able to film one in not too distant future and the model in our video also has the panoramic sunroof so we can open it and enjoy And if you want a bit more sporty drive you can put the transmission the gear selector here to S which is the sport mode and then of course you have shifting on higher revs but let's put the car back to drive as now it's time to just relax and cruise around the city
Okay guys, so that was it. Thank you very much for watching this video. Tell me in the comments how you like the car. And do subscribe as there will be plenty of more to come. See you on the next one. Bye bye.